build challenge. I'll be building a black house. And I'll be building a pink house. So make sure to comment down below which house you like better. Oh, I'm taking you down, Kev. Oh, in your dreams. Okay, so we're gonna build our houses on our own and then give each other a full tour at the end. So make sure you stay to the end to see our entire house reveal. Okay, now get out of here. You can't right, look at my I'm house. Going, go, going. go. Okay, so this starter home is not pink, so I need to build a new house. All right, let's see what house I can choose. Oh my gosh, so they have the pink donut shop. I could use that one. Or they have a party house. Or there's a castle. All right, I think I'm gonna choose the celebrity mansion. Am I a celebrity? No, no, I'm definitely not a celebrity, but I want the celebrity mansion. Okay, I'm buying the celebrity mansion. Oh my gosh, it is so cute. But what the heck, there's purple on it. There's not allowed to be purple on it. I need to change the color ASAP. Okay, we're changing it. So there's a light pink here, or we could do a dark pink. I kinda like the dark pink. Okay, yeah, we're going with that. Okay, now let's go inside and start some decorating. Ugh, this house is so lame and boring. It definitely needs to be pinkified. Ugh, is this supposed to be like the movie room? This is so gross. Yeah, I'm definitely changing this whole house. This floor is adorable. I literally love the squiggly line. So cute. I'm getting it. What about the walls? Wait, do these patterns clash? Mm, I don't really care. I'm getting this wall. Now I'm getting rid of this gross furniture. It is not pink. Goodbye. Okay, that is much better. Now I'm just in a plain empty room. Okay, the donut section is definitely a vibe. Look at all the furniture. It's like all pink. Oh, I'm gonna have fun with this. Okay, so so far the room is coming together. I got the genius idea to line up all of these blocks, all these pink blocks, obviously, and then I'm gonna put a TV right on top of it. So it's gonna be like a TV stand. <gasps> what about this rainbow neon light? It's so cute. Okay, I am for sure getting that. It really just sets the vibe of the room. Okay, I'll just use the futuristic TV. There's like no color in it, so I feel like it'd be fine. See, look how cute is that stand I made. And the unicorn rug for the entrance is perfect. And I'm gonna put this heart rug on the wall. I mean, that's fine, even though it's a rug, right? And I'll put a heart lamp right here, right as I walk into the door. I mean, look at that. It makes it so much brighter in here. And then I'll give them a cute little seat to sit on as they walk in the door to take their shoes off. Honestly, I think Layla's gonna be very impressed. This poster has pink in it. It's called the Lazy Day Art Wall. That is so cute. This is the perfect wall to put it on. You know, I actually decided I want two TVs because I'm a baller. <gasps> oh my gosh, how could I forget the heart throne? I'm literally just gonna put it like right in the center, right when you walk in. This is where we can go and sit and take all of our selfies. Maybe we can take some TikToks in front of this. And then of course, I'm gonna add some heart windows in this house. I don't know what's going on with this area back here. Maybe I'll do like a dining room table. What the heck? Is there no pink long tables? This is preposterous. Maybe I'll just use a bunch of the small ones and combine them together. <gasps> this one has a cute little butterfly on it. Oh, Layla is really gonna love that. She loves butterflies. And since it's only gonna be me and Layla in this house, I'll put my chair on this side. And then I'll have her chair on this side so that we can eat dinner together. Ooh, maybe I'll set up some donuts on both of our tables for us. We both love donuts. How could I forget the chocolate fountain? I love the chocolate fountain. Okay, I'm gonna put it right here. Literally like in the middle of the house. This is coming together so nicely. Okay, now I'm gonna go upstairs and do all the bedrooms. One eternity later. All right, move over, Kens, because you thought you could build a decent house. Absolutely not. I'm gonna build an absolutely incredible house, even though I am a noob, but I think she's already trying to sabotage me because my house is pink? Why? I played this one time. Who gave me a pink house? This needs to change. Okay, we're gonna get a new house. This is too tiny. It's not satisfactory enough. I have a lot to choose from, and if we're doing a black house, what is- the scary house? Okay, she's a contender. Or the crooked house? This is, this is, this is kind of scary. It'd be kind of cool if it was black. Okay, I thought I was going to look around a little more and like shop for a house for a bit before I commit, but I'm going to buy a scary house. <laughs> It's very scary. So it's saying that the paint color is green, but all I'm seeing is that the lighting is green and that the outside is actually this like off brown black. But I guess it's fine. Let's see if I change it to black. Oh, it just looks like empty. It's like completely abandoned, but it kind of suits my vibe, right? Like I would take an IG pick like this. Well, first of all, there's a dead crow on my porch. Very on brand. Okay, this almost isn't fair to Ken's because this is like such a vibe. What would I change? I lo love it in here. Okay, first let's just start with the floors because hardwood, absolutely not. This is, no. Oh, 
No. Ooh, be easy to clean. I kind of like that. A little black and white tile. Ooh, she's kind of scary. Is that cheating because it's not fully black? Or just like a black abyss? Oh, a little black dino. Okay, it's definitely not trying to pick that. This one? Mm, it's giving Chuck E. Cheese. It's getting scary for me. I mean, since it's already kind of like a dungeon, I really like this weird tile. And it's not really black. It's black and like dark gray. But Mackenzie didn't make the rules very clear. So I'm going to do exactly what I want. Honestly, I got pretty lucky with exactly how this is looking. So I'm going to just like pick away at what I want to keep and what I want to get rid of. Um, The stay out sign is very good. But I'm really not vibing with this molten jacuzzi. Like this water feature is not one that I'm that excited about. So I'm going to sell it for no, no dollars. Just open up this entire area. Now that I took away the weird like molten lava bath, it's very dark in here. So I'm going to add a weird window. I'm just doing whatever I want. Oh, I kind of like it. It kind of looks like jail bars. You know, you're locked into my house now. You can't go anywhere. I also feel like this whole area is very like bland. And I, I kind of want to get one of these carpets. I don't know. This is the only black one. So I'll just do this. Put it over here. Maybe. Uh, do we want carp? No. Uh, there's fine. I don't know what's kind of creeping me out myself, honestly. <laughs> Let's see these categories. Oh, spooky house. Here we go. Okay, we are short potion mushroom stone throne. Is that what that is over there? No, I, I think that's exactly what I need for when I take my shoes off. Oh, lovely. I'll, I'll be sitting there. Oh, oh, sorry. I didn't realize you turn it around. There we go. Well, I guess I have one over there too, but it, there's nothing wrong with having a couple. Real nice. Honestly, this carpet's grossing me out. I'm getting rid of it. I hate it. But I have to say, I do not like this mushroom. The Ken's is not going to be happy with that. That is a burgundy. No, that's not black. Yeah, getting rid of these mushrooms too. I do like to eat mushrooms though. A few moments later. Okay, so I finally found a section that makes sense. Just the living room section. Let's check out seating. Because maybe we want to have a TV room. Maybe that's what will be over here. You can sit and watch TV with your red lanterns, I guess. Ooh, fancy sofa. That's black. Oh, ew. It's like a weird navy. Absolutely not. How about this curved chair? Can I change the color? Oh my gosh, I can. Amazing. So I'm just going to have two chairs here for Ken's and me sitting together. Okay. Well, that's kind of a vibe. Now I'm going to put a TV here on the wall. Honestly, I didn't find a table that I liked, but look at this whole TV setup I could have. I mean, it has a little white, but whatever. I oh, can I change the color? <gasps> I can change the color. It's not black enough. That's all I got to say. All right. He's kind of fun. This is this is a great spot. If you don't want to hang out here, what are you doing? I'm going to put these chairs more around this dinner table so more people can sit with me. Well, I mean, I guess I'll just have two, one for Ken's as well. But she, she gets a throne like me. I kind of really like these chains on the ceiling. I think I'm going to add some more. More chains all over there. Nice. Maybe some more. Oh, oh, oh. I'm just put them on the wall. That's cool. All right. Oh, it's kind of like going into the doorway. Oh, a cute candle for my table. That's so good. <gasps> Amazing. I love that. It's mood lighting. Oh, and then I'm going to put a door in here because that's where my friends are going to hang out. Look at all this space for when my friends come and hang out. I'm not going to lock them in there. No, no way. This is the house for fun. Oh, the basement is just nothing. Ready to see my pink house tour? I'm ready. I need to see the big reveal. You are going to be shook. It is fantabulous, if I do say so myself. It's very pink already on the outside, so I can only imagine. There's no way this is real. Do you like it? My eyes are burning, Kens. This is a lot of pink. How could you ever sleep in a house like this? I literally am obsessed with it. This can't be real. How could you live like this? If my house looked like this in real life, oh my gosh, I would be so happy. Wait, look at this throne here, okay? We're going to take selfies here. I do like it. It's I like a picture moment. Isn't it so cute? Kens, it has two crowns. I know, but for both of us, because yeah. we're both princesses. We're the besties. Oh, you're like the evil dark princess that no one likes. I'm kidding. <laughs> oh my god. That's what heavy. That was so mean. But you are like the dark princess, and I'm like the pink princess. Aw, that's kind of cute, Ken. Okay, show me around. Let me see this crib. Okay, so this is like the living room where we chill and hang out, and the coffee table is made out of donuts. So if you ever get hungry, you can just go, ah, and you just eat the donut. I have a little snack. Yeah, exactly. I like it. And then here, I actually have two TVs, if you can see that. Wow. Because sometimes you want to watch your own shows, like the scary shows, and then I want to watch like the cute shows, like the princess shows. Very nice. I like that. Exactly. Exactly, and we can still hang out but watch our own type of shows. Oh, no, that makes sense. And then I guess we just wear headphones. Yeah, exactly, that can yeah, work. That's fine. And then right here is where you take off your shoes. You walk in the door, sit down, and take off your shoes, just They're like that. Amazing, we sit together. Exactly. Wow, it's like we're on the bus together.
together. So right here is a cute little painting. I don't know what it is, but it's like a lazy painting. It has a turtle in it, and turtles are always cute. Kids, it's a little girl sleeping on top of a turtle shell. I know, that's why it's so adorable. It's very cute. And then down here is our dining room. So I would sit here when we have dinner together, and then you would sit all the way on the other side, like right here. Amazing, and I like the butterflies on the table. Yeah, I did the butterflies for you because I know you like butterflies. So cute. And then we have donuts for dinner because like, who doesn't want donuts for breakfast, lunch, and dinner? No, it's just the donut house. This is a donut home. And then what about this? This is a chocolate fountain. Like the whole thing is chocolate and you could just have chocolate and donuts and everything together. Kent, you're gonna have too much sweets if you live there and you have access to a chocolate fountain all the time. No, we're gonna be on a sugar high. That's true, we'll never sleep again. Oh my gosh, it's giving me a headache though, Kenz. I can't believe I actually think this is a cute house. Okay, this is the kitchen. I actually do love it. Like, no lie, I, I'm very proud of this house. I love the island a lot. Do you? It's like a bakery island. Oh my God, it's literally adorable. And then I have cabinets over here and on the walls and a little sink to wash your hands and cook your food at. Amazing. And then if you ever get tired, you can just take a seat just like this. Who's the girl on the poster? I don't know, but I thought she looked really cute. I think she's like Elsa or something, like a she, pink Elsa. She is really cute. Okay, and then down here, this is just a little oh. quick down here, okay? This is the pool area. How did you install a pool, Kent? Just came with my house. You could just go for a quick dip, just like this. That's amazing. And then we have a spotlight on you because sometimes the pool gets like a little cold, so like the light heats it up a bit. <laughs> Why does it look like you're in the sky in that window? It's freaking me out. Because I am in the sky. Okay, we're done with this room. Let me show you the upstairs, okay? You're okay. gonna love it. Okay, let's see. Okay, now up here, it may look boring to the simple eye, but let me show you the bedrooms. That's where the magic happens, okay? Okay, that's where the sleep happens. All right, this room here is the toddler room. This is from when I have a little baby when I'm older and she's gonna go in this room here. That's so cute, Ken. This is like a ball pit. Like, you can actually play in this. Well, Ken, you're not gonna let a baby play in a ball pit. It's gonna get squished. And then this is her little baby carriage that she can go and I can tuck her in at nighttime and give her a little kiss. Mwah. Those colors are so cute. I know, right? It's like little Easter colors. And then over here, this is where I like sit and hang out as I watch the kid play in the ball pit to make sure she doesn't suffocate and die. No, that's true. She can't suffocate. And I know that's definitely gonna be a problem. Yeah, exactly. All right, and this is my little just sitting area. I think it's called the lounge area, whatever you wanna call this. Very cute. Maybe you want to read a book, take a seat, read a book, whatever you want to do. It's up to you in this area. And then outside is like the balcony. Oh. So yeah, this is just my little balcony here so I can wave to all you peasants down there. Hi, Mackenzie. I'm a peasant. I mean, look at this house. It's like a perfect size for me. That's perfect. It's very cute. It's actually very large. Okay, now let me show you the other rooms, okay? Okay. So over here, this is the bathroom. So this is where we're going to be doing a funky business. What is that wallpaper? What do you mean? It's little pandas. Aren't they cute? I'm Honestly, I was just shocked when I saw it. It was just kind of a lot at one time. You oh. didn't, well, look, we're having a bubble bath. No, that's nice. That's really nice. You know, we do love our bath bombs, No, right? we do love our bath bombs. And then if you ever have to go to the bathroom, like pee or poo or whatever else oh, you have yeah. to do in there, you can use that. And then here is the shower. And yeah, I don't know what's going on, but I'm currently in the shower. <laughs> But this is my bathroom. Any questions or comments? No, I'm good, but I do have to poop now. It's so gross. <laughs> okay, go. Okay, anyways, next room. Is this the last room, Kent? Yeah, this is the very last room. Can you guess what room this is gonna be? Your bedroom? How did you know? Wow, maybe I'm a little smart. Okay, and here is my bedroom. Wow. Do you like it? I love, wait, what is, where are the stairs going? To what? So this here is for us when we can have slumber parties, okay? So you would sleep down here. Amazing. Actually, I would sleep down here, and then you could sleep up here, because you're a little littler than me, and this one's a little smaller. It's a little baby, the baby crib. Sorry. Exactly, so you sleep in the baby crib, and then I'll sleep down here. That's but we'll have a slumber party, and we'll hang out, and we'll watch TV. That sounds really fun. I like your aquarium, too. Yeah, I have some fish, but we have to make sure we feed them so they don't die. That always happens to me. Kids, you're a terrible fish mother. And then this is my throne, because I have one downstairs, but I just want my own, too, you know? You want one upstairs for when you're just sitting and thinking things. Exactly, and then my wallpaper is butterflies because who doesn't love butterflies? You love butterflies. They're the best. Okay, and that is my house. What are you going to rate it? I think you should rate it on a scale of 1 to 10. Okay, if I could rate it on a scale of 1 to 10, I'm taking one point off because it's too much pink. 
What? You yeah. could never have too much pink. No, Are it you is. crazy? Well, it's my own personal rating. I know, but... Oh and then God. um, one point off because you're making me sleep in the baby side of the crib. What the heck? At least I gave you a bed, you dink. So I'm going to give you an eight. An eight? I think it's a pretty good rating. I mean, it's okay. I honestly deserve a 10, though. What do you guys think? Comment down below what you would rate this house. Please, don't comment an eight. Everyone should comment a 10. Would you live in it with me? Yeah, of course. Aww. With my eyes closed. Okay, I want to see your house now. Okay, Kenz, out of all of the houses here, which one do you think is mine? <laughs> oh my god, probably the scary one right in front of you and the one that says Leo Hansen, obviously. <laughs> Kenz, do you like my dead crow on the outside? No, not at all. Why is it dead? What, did you kill it? Uh, maybe for its innards. We're going inside. Ew, oh my god. Okay, Kenz, welcome to my home. What the heck? Why is there skulls and like dead things all around you? Because Kenz, it's a spooky house, so I wanted to keep up with the vibe. What is that statue? So you come in the front door, and there's just this really nice statue that was already here for me when I moved in of a man who's... Lifting the weight of the world on his shoulders. He looks so strong. He's he's strong and he's stressed because, you know, if that falls, he's going to have a lot of back issues. Yeah, no kidding. And then over here we walk in and this is where you and me are going to sit and have a nice steak dinner. Ooh, I love steak dinner. Right? Um, And that room is where I keep my friends when they come and visit and, and they're not allowed to come out. So that's their special room. Your what? My friends. Your friends that come <laughs> and visit? So is that where I would go? No, you're different. You're an acquaintance. <laughs> oh my God. I'm worried about you, Lail. Now we're going over here to our little nice seating area. There's two chairs for you and me. We don't do couches, just chairs. We like to be a little far apart. I don't like to cuddle too much. And here we come into our nice TV room where we got two nice little separated comfortable chairs. Fun little lantern. Is there a tree in the wall? Yeah, it's how I like it. The greenery, it really is, makes me feel at home. And Wait, what the heck is in that room over there? Kenz, this is your bedroom. My bedroom? Why does it say RIP? Am I supposed to be dead? Kenz, this is where, this is where only babies and pets can sleep. You're gonna kill your babies and pets and put them in the grave? But you're gonna sleep there. That's your sleep spot now. What is wrong with you? Because you need your own little room. You really do have a dark side. No, I don't. I really, I just think this is pleasant. So you'd have a, the best sleep ever. Like, what kind of sleep are you gonna get other than when you're dead? Um, I think we should go to the downstairs first. Okay, show me Come the downstairs. Come to my basement. Oh my gosh, there's a party going yeah. on down here. This is where we do parties, Ken's. This is where I'd like to DJ and perform my own songs. This is kind of sick. Do you I, have any, like, dance moves? Um, yeah, and, and I only listen to my own music. This is how I like to rip it up. Wow! Whoa. Oh my yeah. gosh, you know how to do that? Yeah, I, I, whoa! Oh I my gosh, roll. you're pretty sick, honestly. <laughs> you practice in your spare time? Well, this, well, I have a dance floor in my house, so I can just <laughs> dance all the time. Okay, that was good. Okay, so now that we've had a nice tour of this area, you can sit here while I dance. Okay, I'll watch you dance. <laughs> and here's my nice special podium. Oh, very cute. Where I do live performances with the piano that I don't know how to play. Why don't I play the piano? I know how to play hot crust buns, and then you can sing. <laughs> That's perfect. <laughs> that would be so much fun. Would you guys like to see a rendition of hot crust buns by the best? <laughs> um, Ken's, I put a black card on the wall because I was thinking of you. Oh, that is so sweet. Yeah. Why are you so sweet to me? Because I love you, bestie. And then this is my special room. What the heck is this room, Lail? Well, sometimes I really miss hot places and going on vacation, so I made an inside vacation spot in my basement. Wait, but you literally colored everything black. Everything looks just burnt and dark and well, scary. Ken's, this is a black build challenge. I know, but how is this a vacation vibe? No, it is a vibe. Look at I'm really having a good time. Just because you're sitting on the ground doesn't mean you're having a good time. Well, look how much fun I'm having. I haven't sat in a while. I've just been giving you a tour this whole time. Okay, now we're going upstairs because now we, if we stay down here too long, we're going to start partying. Okay, show me upstairs. Okay. I don't know about that though. Let's get out of here. This is my recreational area where I keep my food and my drinks and my big <laughs> vat of acid. <laughs> what? This is like your kitchen? Oh, I could take a shower in here. You're going to take a shower in your kitchen? In my vat of acid. Kent, it's my everything. It's oh everything. I is that a fridge? Yeah. Oh, and my pet bowls for my, for my chickens. And now you have chicken? Ah! Yeah. And then up here is my bedroom. I'm hanging out here. This is my nice cobweb bed and my big circle -y Wait, well, is bedroom. this the last room? Yeah. Well, what about the bathroom? Oh, I just go outside. What? What is wrong with you? Well, Kenzie, it was more important for me to have a spot for my vat of acid than for me to go to the bathroom. You have to be able to pee. No, I don't need to. I have cups. What would you rate it, Mackenzie? Don't you love my little home? No, literally not at all. It's so creepy and scary, and I want to get out of it like ASAP Rocky. Well, 
then what would you rate it? Well, I feel bad because you rated mine an eight, but I'm gonna be honest, like, I don't see any pluses to this. Aww, what do you but I'll give you a plus because you gave me a seat to sit at when I'm eating dinner. Yeah, and a, and a spot in front of the TV and your own bedroom in the with the tombstone. Yeah, I don't like that bedroom at all. That's a negative. Oh, okay. So I'm gonna give you like a two. Okay. <laughs> don't take it personal though. You already hear first, guys. If you like pink better, give Ken's a good rating. If you like black better than get come on and back me up here i think this would be a blast i don't mean to be mean i just i i don't want to from me oh, please guys give give me a good rating come on i worked really hard on this <laughs>